Hi there, this is Mr. Boyd. Today, we are going to talk about how to delete a file in Windows 10 that says it's in use. Okay, let's begin. The first thing you want to do is rebooting your computer. After rebooting, try again to delete the file or folder. If it didn't work out, stay with me as I will show you how to delete it. For the purpose, I will create a file and open it. Now, go to Start menu, type Command Prompt, right-click on the top result, and select Run as Administrator. Navigate to the path where the file is located by entering CD and the directory name. In my case, it's located under Folder Name, Test Folder. Type DIR to see what files are in the directory. Now, you can see the file that's in use and its extension. Next, type DEL forward slash F, the file name, the extension, and press Enter. This will force delete the file that it's in use. Keep in mind that a file deleted using the DEL command does not move it to the recycle bin, but deletes it permanently. Use the DEL command with caution. If you have any questions, ask them in the comment section below. I will be more than happy to answer them. I hope you enjoyed my tutorial. Make sure to subscribe to my channel for more tutorials like this one. See you in the next video.